Uh, over in the slightly crazier state of California, uh, a new law has come in. I couldn't quite believe this when I read this. A new law's come in saying that all large to toy retailers in California have to have, quote, gender-neutral toy aisles. And apparently this is because uh, uh, instead of having a sort of clear aisle for boys' toys and a clear aisle for girls' toys, that's a bit too, um, it's a bit too, uh, I don't know. It's, it's, it's a bit too obvious. It's yeah. a bit too, uh, well, the 20th century and every century before that. Um, and, uh, and so apparently now, you know, sort of children and their parents should be able to sort of skip around the aisles and choose whatever toy is most suitable for their gender identity. What do you make of this law? And law it is. Well, I'll tell you, I did live in Los Angeles for three years before I fled to Nashville, Tennessee. And I'll tell you, there's a lot of problems in California. Homelessness, taxes, regulations, illegal immigration, drug use, open-air drug markets, filth on the streets, human feces on the streets, needles mm. on the streets. And I would think that gender-neutral toy aisles would end on the last of list of priorities for Governor Newsom and the rest of the Democrats that control that state. But... Alas, we've discovered that that is their priority, finding retailers that have already been through enough with the COVID lockdowns and shutdowns, finally regaining their ground after that time, also inflicted on them by Democrat politicians. And now they're going to be fined if they don't have gender neutral toy <laughs> sections. I'd also yeah. remind people that in California, because they're felon coddling laws and policies, you can actually steal $450 more than these retailers would be fined. Yes. And that would be considered a misdemeanor. So let's just just put that in perspective. You can shoplift, and that's essentially the same thing as a toy aisle that's not uh, gender neutral. Well, that's uh, California uh, priorities for you. I don't know why everybody hasn't fled that state.